back on the bike after a dramatic start to his British Superbikes career. 20-year-old Ryan Vickers may only be a few weeks into his debut season, but he's already experienced enough injury turmoil to test even the most seasoned rider. Donington Park, broke my collarbone. Um, that was a uh, silly little crash across the front. Um, and I guess on the first initial impact when I hit the floor, because it was quite fast, and then I broke my, broke my collarbone, I think. And then we was getting fit back and ready for um, Brands Hatch. But in FP3 at Brands Hatch, I had another little crash, knocked myself out, um, and broke a little bone in my foot. But it's going to take more than that to keep Ryan off the track, especially on his home round of the championship. Although he'll once again be the youngest competitor on the grid, he knows this circuit better than most, having grown up racing here. And he certainly knows all about making history, having recently become the first National Superstock 600 champion, a series for riders under the age of 25, to make the step up directly to the superbikes. It's just so much different, the bike. The way the bike, you have to ride it around the circuit, it's just so different to the 600, and that's the biggest thing, is just be, taking that step back and relearning the circuit, understanding how you need to ride the bike. Well, it's relatively quiet here now, but come the weekend, this place is going to be buzzing because organisers estimate around 50,000 people are going to come through the gates to watch some of the very best riders in the world. And with thrills, spills and the odd photo finisher given, fans are in for another action-packed couple of days. Last weekend was a great day for the British sport with the, the cricket and tennis and Formula One. Well, we're, we're tracking this level of quality of sport out every single weekend. So um, uh, unlike other sports, you can uh, see, uh, see and uh, talk to the heroes, see them brush by at about 200 miles an hour on the track and then get their autograph and see them in the pits, uh, our popular pit lane walkabout. Talking of popularity, a good showing from Ryan would definitely go down well with the locals. And with the weight of a home crowd behind him, this time he'll be hoping it's records he'll be breaking this weekend. Andy Ward, ITV News, Snetterton in Norfolk.